Welcome, in this video I will show you how to fix the issue when your buttons aren't working on your uh, Asus ROG Xbox Li X device. First of all, open the Ormary Crate application on your device. If you have uh, these three buttons uh, functioning on your device, you can press the uh, for example, this this one to open the command center and then uh, enable the embedded controller by tapping on this icon. Uh, or alternatively, you can uh, open the start menu and start searching for Armory Crate. Open this application. Now go to keyboard shortcuts and uh, create a shortcut to open the command center. For example, you can use the one presented here, Control alt c And now uh, open the start menu once again, just to open your keyboard. And press Control alt c And this will open the command center. And now you just have to in uh, close your keyboard and enable the embedded controller. And now sh everything should start working for you. But uh, if you don't see this option here, uh, tap Customize, then find the embedded uh, controller and add, uh, well, s uh, select Add, then find Embedded Controller and add this uh, feature to this list. Now, if this didn't resolve your issue, then try force restarting your device. So hold down the power button until your device fully powers off. Then release the power button. And then press it once again to turn it on. And sometimes a full reboot clears temporary in input issues. Now let's wait until it's uh, turned on again. Sign into your device. And now uh, you have to, if, if this problem wasn't resolved for you this way, then uh, Try to update everything on your device. So, for example, open settings on your device, then select Windows Update option on the sidebar. Check for any available updates, especially for the ones that are located in advanced options. Uh, here you're gonna find optional updates. And if you have some driver updates here, then of course download and install them all. Uh, wait until the updates are installed and uh, then probably restart your device afterwards. Besides, open the find and open the My Asus application to find more specific updates for your device. Uh, here you're gonna have to go to System Update and wait until this app finds any updates for your device. And if it does find any, then of course download and install them. And also update your system in the Ormary Crate application. So let's open it again. Now open the update center, check for updates. And if there are any updates, then uh, as I said before, uh, download, install them, wait until your device is restarted, and then check if your button started working. Uh, and in case uh, this didn't help you, then uh, you're gonna have to res reset the uh, Armory Crate application. In order to do this, you're gonna have to install the official uh, un uninstall tool. So open your web browser and search for search for Armory Crate. Uninstall tool. Uh, f 
find uh, the official rog.asus.com website and open it. Select. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, find the. It's not the one. Okay. Um. Ex uh, okay. So what you have to do is uh, go to uh, to the Armory Crate support page. Let's let's go go back from here and let let me just find this page on Google because this is uh, the, just the instruction. Let's let's simply search for Armory Crate, uh, then go to Asus.com website, and here we're gonna find the Armory Crate uninstall tool. Tap Show All. Here it is. Tap Download next to it. Then open this zip file. Open the file inside. Tap on the application file. Tap Extract All. Confirm. Then open the folder, open the uninstall tool, tap yes, tap uninstall, wait until the application is uninstalled. And once the application is uninstalled, tap rest restart now to reboot your device. Then wait until it's restarted. Okay, now let's sign back into your device and uh, now let's reinstall the uh, Armory Crate application. We can do that, uh, reinstall it from the same website. Just uh, search for Armory Crate once again. Uh, okay, let's download it from the official website. Just tap download. Uh, select this. Armory Crate and Aura. Open the zip file. Open the folder inside it. Open an installer. Tap Extract. Run this application. Tap Yes. Then wait. Okay, I'm sorry for the brightness. So tap start and then let's wait until the uh, armory crate is installed back on this device. Okay, now tap I understand. Uh, tap yes. Then let's wait once again. And now let's reopen the application to finish this process. Uh, now, once the application is reopened, let's go back to the update center. Let, okay, let, let, let's give it a couple of seconds. Agree. Yes. Next. Let's go to update center, check for updates right now check if everything is up to date and now let's update the core update now and let's wait for the following update to install then I'm not sure if we'll have to restart the device, but uh, surely we'll need to do that.
Okay, so now you can launch Armory Crate, but anyway, uh, if your buttons didn't start working now, so you can, which you can, by the way, t test them in this, uh, in this app, and, but if they didn't start working for you, then uh, force restart your device once again by holding the power button down until your device sh fully shuts down. And then restart your device by pressing the power button once again. And once your device starts up again, uh, everything should uh, return back to normal at this point. But if there is any hardware issues on your device, there are any hardware issues on your device, uh, and if your, uh, which is very probable, if your uh, buttons remain unresponsive after software fixes, uh, then uh, you should definitely contact Asus Support Center, Customer Support Center, or uh, your uh, dealer for warranty, service, or repairs. And at this point, that's it. I hope that you liked this video, I hope that it helped you, and if it did, please consider subscribing to our channel, leave us a like and a comment below, and I'll see you in the next one.